So let's check it out. Kensuke Tanaka, gender, male, occupation, insurance company sales manager. He's 42. Okay, so is it July 24th? Macaron. Oh yeah, macarons. <laughs> I've been on such a binge for these lately. I've been like almost buying them almost every day. The vanilla ones are my favorite. How does it say? I forgot how to read this. Kohyo? Kohei? Hatsubaichu. So on sale right now. Anata ni aitai desu. I want to meet you. You can meet the person of your dreams, basically. the Your your fate person. Hotel Takatsuki. So, escape the daily life at our hotel. We're waiting for you. This looks cool. Sometime before I get on. Do I click? Oh yeah. I can use a little smoke break. Ah, uh, do you smoke? Man, my throat's parched. That's maybe because you smoke. <laughs> I better get something. Also, my stomach wouldn't hurt. Would hurt around this time. I wouldn't want to hold it during the ride. Okay, so we want to... Oh. This looks cool. Okay, so we want to have a drink. We want to have a poop. <laughs> and we want to have a smoke. Oh god, this is so accurate. I mean, not the blurriness, but the colors. Oh, Shiotan again. It's that this person always mentions Shiotan because it's the it's another YouTuber, I think. Well, here's the toilet, so Oh, I can't go in. Oh. Whoa, that fucked me up, the reflection on this wall. <laughs> Time to poop. And I oop and I poop. Seems like the back stall is for me. There we go. Ultimate poopage. Oh god, it's a Japanese style toilet. Well, you're fucked. Time to squat. I guess I did it. <laughs> Was that a good poop? You wanna wash your hands? If you pooped, you definitely should wash your hands, dude. <gasps> no! I'm a dirty bitch. Um, oh God, what is that again? It's, I forgot the first character. So it's like saving water. Like, don't, don't waste water, please. Don't go in there. Buy a drink. And I oop and I poop. <laughs> so I got my drink. Now we need to find a place to smoke. This is my tea. Nihonji ni wa yappari ocha. For Japanese people, tea is the best. Oh, bunny! That's so cute! I want to protect my child. So we can provide you with uh, gentle examinations to protect, support your precious family. So it's a vet. Yeah, dobutsu byoin. So it's a vet. Gachima. <laughs> That's another YouTuber, right? Smoke room. I'm so happy 
No offense to anyone in chat who smokes, but I'm so happy that they introduced smoking areas. So we don't have to all smell it. Did something just pass by? Was it a reflection? It looked like a... Like a shadow. Oh. Must be me smoking. Ooh! Ooh! My own smoke is scaring me! Can I leave? I'm done smoking. I don't like this. What if there's suddenly like another... Oh, I'm done. What if there's like a second puff of smoke out of nowhere? Well, I think I did all the things I wanted to do. Sarari man gori. The businessman gorilla. Originaru sticker. Oh, it's a sticker. Oh. Wait, what's the post from the back? What's wrong with that person? Is she alright? Miss Booba! Miss Booba, is that you? Yeah! <laughs> I recognized you inst instantly! Holy shit! That's fucking awesome! Anata no chikaku ni mo shinsetsu na hito ga imasu. Mawari no hito o tayotte mite kudasai. So, there are gentle people around you. Um, try and um, rely on them. <laughs> That's awesome. You must be one of the top backers then. I'm a backer too now, but I don't think... I don't think I get a poster. I'm not like one of the higher ones. This is so fun to look at. This is super accurate, by the way. Like, they always have these... These, like, benches like that. And then the rings you can hold onto and then all the commercial stuff. This is an old looking train though. Because normally um, you have like just monitors as well that just play like commercials and stuff. Like just TVs. Now I have to get my favorite seat. The corner of the second coach. You have a favorite seat? Anato no shinsetsu na kokoro miete masu yo. I can see your kind heartness. Kind heartedness. Oh, because you're saving a seat for someone who's injured. They're priority seats. You can't see them here. Usually each each cart has like a corner like this. Like this bench would be a different color and have like medical um, logos or something around it. Meaning that they're priority seats so that you have to keep them free for um, pregnant people, elderly, people who are injured. Look at her feet! That can't be comfortable. Are you okay? She's the OL that always rides on the on the last train. OL is the uh, office lady. I want to leave her alone though. I'm tired. I'm guessing she is as well. She's fucking creepy. Don't look at me like that. Mienai mono wa shinjitai. Shinjitai. Oh, shinjinai type desu ka? So are you the kind of type that doesn't believe in stuff that you can't see? Ghosts. Yure o bake no koto nara. Ore. Hmm. I think it's kind of saying like contact me if you wanna... If it has to do with ghosts or monsters. Shinjitai hou ga mi no tame desu yo. It's better if you do believe. For your own safety. Bread! Oh, chigiri panda. Panda. That's the... We've seen that in other games as well. Where did I study Japanese? Leida University. Live in the Netherlands? Oh yeah, Leida. Oh, excuse me? What the fuck is that? Was he on my face? Didn't my stop just pass by? Or is it just my imagination? Maybe I can talk to someone to confirm it. Cicadas on the face. I I hate to say, but it really bothers me that he didn't wash his hands after going to the bathroom. <laughs> Especially in now in the current day and age where it's really important that you wash your hands a lot. It really bothers me. Do you see what just happened? 
Yes, I did. But I can't bring my energy up to do anything about it. Well, good for you. That was my stop. Now I have to take the taxi home. Shall I go talk to the conductor? How nice of her. Obvious she's exhausted from her overtime work. I can tell by her eyes. No, no, please. I can't let you do that. I'll go. You can stay here and rest. Okay. Well, let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Why would you... It seems pretty out of the ordinary for... To go talk to the conductor, right? That's cute. Oh. What's that sound? Did you hear that? It was something falling. Stay home de game shio. Let's uh, play games while we stay home. Is um I actually haven't followed any Japanese corona news, but is is stay home, is that what they called the lockdown? Stay home. Furukon. I don't know what that means. What is that sound? Wait, what? Shizen ni wa tsukurenai sekai. That doesn't make sense. Is he saying let's go to a world where that's not natural? Namaji ajito. Oh, the fish! Shimamura <laughs> Erufu. I think those are all like backer names. Oh, yeah, this is definitely a backer. Oh? Who's this? Oh, does he have cicada in his little basket? It's so dark outside. Oishi okome o anata no oiede. So, delicious rice for your family. Guma chan. <laughs> hey, dude. You're not creepy at all. Escaped? Bzz. Three escaped. How? Bzz. I'm in a hurry. Could you please move aside? Escaped. Not in a very good mood. Bzz. It's no good. He's not listening. Whatever it is, I better get what he wants. I have to find his cicada for him? Well, they should make a ton of noise, right? Should be able to hear them. Oh. They're silent. Well, that sucks. You should be like, making noise, buddy. Or are you dead? I have one for you. I think that counted. Do you think they're like on the windows? Shout if you... They tend to quiet down when you get too close. Oh! I didn't know that. I've always heard them, but... Even living in Japan, where I heard them every day in summer, I never really could see where they were. Like, you hear them, but it's hard to locate them. Well, holler if you see one. I do really want to get back to the translation project. It, it's it's not a nice feeling to like look at a poster and be like I used to be able to read that and now it slipped away. I I was sitting here when I got one on my face, right? So Oh, there he is. We got him in Louisiana too. Their sound carries for like half a mile. Holy shit. That's really far. Oh. Is this one? Should I try and capture it? He's like, let me in! Let me in! Dude, I got your cicada. Cicada. Oh, there it is. Did it. Did he sit down? Bzz, brown ones. Not in a very good mood. 
Oh. You can just go in the conductor's side like that. Hey. Do you need anything? Do I need anything? Yes. I want a train to stop on the next one, please. You forgot to stop on the previous one. Oh. Is that right? I must have been spacing out. Dude! I apologize for the inconvenience. We will prepare you the compensation necessary for the mishap. Please leave your contact information here. Um, if, if anyone ever goes to Japan and you go travel by train, when you're buying your ticket... Ugh. I don't have the time and energy to complain to the railway company. I'm just relieved that it wasn't anything serious. I'll let it pass this time. I don't look forward to tomorrow's work. What am I doing with my life? Okay. When you travel by train in Japan and you go buy a ticket um, and you're traveling by train, look at the people working there. Because there's this interesting thing that they do and I don't know if they realize that they're doing it, but... Um, Japan has this thing called the art of looking busy when you're not actually busy. And even the people when you're buying your ticket, they have this habit of tapping tapping more than they need to on the display and it's really fascinating like when they they basically only have to push two buttons to select your thing but they will always click like an extra like tap on the side of the display even if it's not like tapping anything in particular it just makes it look faster than it actually is and they're just like tick 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 and they always do it <laughs> and I, it's everywhere and then even the the conductor in the train because you can like see into the front of the train he will just be like always like doing an extra like just in the air like his hand gesture or something like and then he when he leaves the station he'll be like to the station and then he goes and he does his thing and then and then he passes another station and he just does that to no one in particular it's just that all of these like little hand gestures that they do that don't do anything. It's really interesting. I've, it always fascinated me traveling by train. I've always noticed it and then once you notice it you just can't let it go. You just see everyone doing it. They just like have these like extra taps and stuff. <laughs> So what are we doing today? Poop? Smoke? So Japanese working people have idle animations. <laughs> Basically, yeah. <laughs> do you want to smoke? I don't know if we like need to do the same. He did say like every day my stomach hurts around this time or something, right? Is he smoking? I guess maybe it's like a daily, kind of like Day of Atonement. Oh, what's happening? Oh no. Oh, what's gonna happen? Can I leave? No? Oh, I can't. the light go off? It looks a little bit darker back there. Um, let's see if we can poop. <laughs> poop is unko in Japan. Japanese unko. Unchi? What's the difference again? Unchi is the turd. Unko is the poop. Unko suru? Let me check. I think that's the difference. Unko. Unko is poop. Feces. It's unko suru, right? To poop. I think so. What's unchi then? Oh. Typed it wrong. Yeah, unchi is poop as well. I think unchi is more the kid's way of saying it. Unchi! Mm 
check ghost chima. Ah, oh, thank you, Crystalia. Let me go out the stall and check it. Thank you, guys. Um, get a drink? There's something really comforting about having a... a daily... rhythm like that. I think I got everything. On the one hand, it's a scary thing, because a part of me is like, oh god, I would hate to be stuck in a thing where every day is the same. Kind of like lockdown. Here it is. <laughs> oh, cute train. But... I remember working in Amsterdam uh, at the translation office and being like super... Um, I, was, I was living on my own at that point and it was really nice to be like, okay, in the mornings I get up at this time, I do this in the morning, then I read this book in the train going to work, then I work, then I come home, I go to the gym, I have dinner, I go to the gym, then I play some games, read the book, go to bed, same time every night, get up, same time every day. There was something really nice about it. I was really, like, structured and well-rested. <laughs> it was nice. <laughs> something to be said for both, I think. There she is again. Not gonna lie, there's a part of me that's comfort comforted by her always being there. Maybe I should talk to her. She creepy though. Um, hey. Typically I wouldn't have the space to talk to anyone, but I feel that the ice between us has broken. I guess it's thanks to the last night's incident. Hey. Did you make it home safe last night? Yeah, unfortunately. Unfortunately? Why? If it's okay with me, I'm all ears. Thank you. But there's nothing to vent about at this point. It's like, my husband, and then the dude's like, oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> it's too late. Hmm. I don't think there's anything late about talking to someone about their struggles. No. It's too late. I'm sorry. It's been tough. I'd rather not talk about it. Please forgive me. Okay. Well, I'm sure you've seen me many times already, but... I'm usually on this train at this time, so, uh... Okay, I'll keep it in mind. That's kind of nice. So it's kind of like his way of saying like, well, I'm here if you want to talk. She's dead. <laughs> maybe, maybe she's been a ghost this whole time. And that's why she's like, it's too late. Hello? What the hell? What's a little girl doing here? Is the little girl? Kids shouldn't be roaming around this train a train this late. Daddy? Do I look like your father? <laughs> yeah, you look different. Hmm. You better go back to your dad. Oh, about that. I can't remember where daddy is. I was chasing a cicada I saw in the window. Now I'm too scared to go back alone. Mister, could you please come with me to find daddy? Either way, I can't let a kid be lost here alone. I guess I have no choice. Sure. Yay! Thank you, mister. Ojisan! Arigato! <laughs> Are you daddy? You look creepy. Mm. He's looking suspicious. At least there's other people on the train too. Ooh, that's kind of creepy, how they're so dark. They kind of look like the ghosts in Kaido, Pulse. I can't talk to anyone, though. Can't even see the kid anymore. I hear- Oh! Um, the stench of alcohol. Huh? 
He's shivering. Hey. What? What the hell are you doing? Please get me out of here. What's wrong? I swear I saw something on this train. I swear. What is that you saw? I don't know. It was something out of this world. He's probably just too drunk. I don't have time for this. Okay, well, I'll let you know when I see something then. Hey, by the way, do you happen to know this girl? Hey, he fell asleep. God damn. What did he see? That was really weird. I heard the snoring and I was like, where the fuck is it coming from? <laughs> the same dude from before. This train seems a lot longer. Oh, here's the end. Oh, it's locked. Okay. Um, I guess we should go back to the kid and ask them if the drunk sleeping is their dad, maybe. Just take him here and be like, that your daddy? <laughs> Up in heaven. <laughs> Oh, he's snoring again. Wait, are they all the same? Are they all to do with glasses? Hey, Bucknery! Oh... I only now realized... Must be a ghost then. That's creepy. It's all the same dude. Hey, mister. What is it? There's something I need to tell you. What is it? I think I've forgotten how my dad looks like. What my dad looks like. How is that even possible? I think it's because he looks like any middle-aged guy. Oh, maybe that's why they all look the same. That's why I thought you were my dad. Boogie woogie woogie. I think the only way is to talk to the ones that look like my dad. Okay. Um... You following me? Oh yeah! Cute! <laughs> <laughs> Do you recognize this child? Excuse me, sorry to bother you. Do you happen to know this girl? What? Don't know. Well, that was that one. Unicorn, thanks for the 21 months. Oh, that reflection freaked me out for a second. Excuse me, sorry to bother you. Do you happen to know this girl? Nope. Why? Looking for her parents? Yeah, she said she's with here with her father. Rare for such a young kid to be here alone. What's wrong with people these days? Good luck to you. What are they carrying? Oh, it's like one of those um, spinny things. We used that in um, when we were looking for the missing kids. What was the game called? Missing children? Excuse me, sorry to bother you. Do you happen to know this girl? No, I don't. I thought you were her father. I saw her sleeping next to you a while time a while time, a while ago. This is the strangest thing I've seen in a while. Haha. <laughs> Nothing funny about it, asshole. You think I'm doing this because I want to? Damn, dude. Is this your daddy? Don't want to wake him up. Anyone want a free child? <laughs> the girl is the ghost. Honestly, I think we're all dead. Excuse me, do you know this girl? No. And? Don't talk to me. That can't be. Her father isn't even on the train. Could it be that he left her alone here? Um, where are you going? That's weird. Oh, I'm gonna lose sight of them. Are they gonna be gone? Oh, I can't see. Oh, they're disappearing. Fuck. Shit. What do you think they were a ghost? Zoom. Noom. Saturday Mongo. Noom. 
Well. The girl is gone. Where'd she go? Oh! What? Whoa. Wait, everyone's gone. There's no people anymore. Oh, the door closed. What does that bell sound? <gasps> the dude fell down. Oh my god. <laughs> the drunk dude. Oh, did we wake up? That's my stop. What was all that? Probably too stressed. Can't even tell a dream from reality sometimes. Damn, dude. Oh, I'm so excited. Now shit's gonna happen. Bright! Too bright. Guess we gotta start with a poopy. Can you imagine having a daily poop at a station? Ugh, I hate pooping somewhere that's not my home. So uncomfortable. Home poops are the best poops. Oh, I can't flush. Oh, no, I can't. Oh! That made me nervous. I thought someone was going to peek over the edge or something. There's someone in here. <laughs> the fuck? I think you just heard. <laughs> Which was the fart. Time to go. Yeah. <laughs> if I was about to poop and someone would knock on the door like that, I'd be like, well, I'm not pooping for the rest of the day. <laughs> it's like a stress reaction. <laughs> Let's get a drink. <laughs> Ghost farts. Okay, so we saw the light flicker back there. It looks fine now. Oh, there it is again. Please go out. That would be fucking amazing. Or that the that one goes out and then the one right in front of us. Now please have that one flicker. That would be fucking amazing. Like it's coming closer. Dude, I am not leaving this smoky smoky shack. Hello? Hmm. <laughs> Let's go say hi to Ms. Booba. Hello, Ms. Booba. Do you like being a pretty lady in this game? Hello. <laughs> mm. 
Cicadas, locusts are a symbol of death and rebirth in some cultures due to how they emerge from the ground after droughts or something. Oh, I don't know. I'm not very familiar on that stuff. Let's see if the lady is here again. Oh, did I have the numbers before? <gasps> She's gone! She's not here! I hope she's okay. She's not here tonight. Well, maybe it was just a good day for her and she didn't have... overtime. The fuck is this? Guess I can't sit in my usual spot. I heard a baby. The side? What? Guess I'll sit somewhere else tonight. Demon baby. In a cage. What is it? Oh. Oh, that looks so cool. What's going on? Blackout? Something wrong with the train. What time is it? 2 a.m.? It's way past the usual arrival time. I have to talk to the conductor. I mean, dude, why do you fall asleep every time? Whoa, that's freaking awesome. Oh, that's so I love how the light goes by it. Is it this way? I think it's the other way. I think this is the back. Just making sure. Okay. Look how cool this looks. Holy shit. I love the lighting traveling through the thing. Okay, number two. I hadn't even noticed the numbers before. What's gonna happen? Number three. I don't see anyone either. Four. Locked. I don't really see anything though. Can even can't even see people sitting because it's so dark. I guess obviously a Saturday man won't have a flashlight on him. Maybe flash on your phone though. Should you go check on the babies? What's wrong? I, don't, I only saw a hand. What's wrong? Can't you see that the train is acting weird? Tried the conductor room, but the door is locked. How can you stay so calm? What do you hear? What? I can help you only when you hear the voices of the natural world, even in the midst of crisis. So please, tell me. Oh, hi. In the order in which you hear them, what do you hear? Forest? Um... We heard cicadas first. What are we doing? Oh, in the order you hear them. Maybe it's carts one through five. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so... 
One is cicada, two is forest. Cicada, forest. Ocean? Seaside. Oh, temple. Festival. Okay. Let's see if I can remember now the order. Oh, thank you, Alexi. So we hear cicadas. Uh, wait, let me start over. Cicadas. Forest. Um, then it was seaside. Temple bell and summer festival. The other world says you indeed hear the voices of the natural world. The other world has allowed me to call the helper. It should be here any second. When you talk to the helper, the train should come to a halt. You are the chosen one, yeah. Well, looks better. What are those boxes? They're my children. I'm just a lover of cats, you see. That didn't sound like cats to me. I always wondered if it's better if you have a cat that like gets stressed out um, from traveling. Like if you put them in a bag or a cage, then cover it up completely so they can't see. Do they realize then where they that they're taken outside of the house? Are you the helper? What are you talking about? Who are you? Wait a second. I know you. You were one of the troublemakers at my high school. Ah, you don't change. Mr. Shimizu, how nostalgic. He's the man who saved me from dropping out. Without him, I wouldn't be in such a position in my company today. But Mr. Shimizu, why are you out this late? Well, it's a hobby of mine to get on the last train ride before going to bed. <laughs> what? Weirdo, he never changes. However, now is not the time for a reunion. Sir, this train isn't stopping for hours, and I'm afraid this train will never come to a stop. Is there anything I can do? Ah, I understand. Okay, listen carefully, kid. You must get off the train before the train reaches the end. My destination is at the end, and trust me, you don't want to go there. There are three stops where you can get off at. However, you must choose the right one. There will be an announcement melody played on every stop. When you hear the same sound as the sound you heard on the home station, get off. Oh, I don't remember. Otherwise, I won't be able to help you later. So be careful, young one. Oh, I don't remember. I don't remember what the sound was. Oh. It's a station. I have no idea. Can't talk to him anymore. Castle music? I don't think it was that, no. Oh, I lagged. New station. This sounds like it. Do you guys agree? No? You don't agree? I 
I'm gonna go with yes. Let's see if it's the right one. I mean, we're, we can replay it. I wasn't paying attention at all at my home station. Okay, August 6th. Huh? Hmm. Looks like your card isn't readable. That's strange. It was working yesterday. Can you let me go this time? I don't want to miss my ride. Hold it right there. Don't you even try to get past. If your card isn't working, you better get the ticket. Can't you help me get a new card though? No can do. You have to do that during the day. Can't help you at this time. I have to get a ticket? Oh. Ticket, ticket, ticket. Where are the ticket machines? Oh, back there? Jump it, run. <laughs> I wonder if my cart's not working because it's taking me to the afterlife. Okay, I got a ticket. What's gonna happen? It's weird to see such deserted stations. Did I just hear something? Do you think we're good? Dude's gone. Do you still want to do your poop? Oh, something coming. Someone just- oh god. Should we go say hi? Something happening to them? I can't go up. Is she crawling this way? You should take the other escalator. Who is she? Oh, geez. The train scared me. The train scared me. Okay, so what choice did we make? Good choice, bad choice? Well, she's not here. Bad choice? Let's see it. No poopy this time, no. What is it? Did it pass your station again? Gotta be kidding me. 
Not stopping again? This isn't funny anymore. What if it's the lady from the train? I don't know. I still don't know if we made the right choice. Oh, there's no one in here. You do it. There's no one driving the train. The train doesn't respond to anything I'm pressing. There's a keyhole. Looks like I need a key to operate it. Okay. Where is the key? It's so dark. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> oh. oh no. We hit someone. Oh, that is cool. Holy shit. Hey, Panda, thanks for the raid. Don't mind us, we're just in a train going to hell. It's like little pieces in the air. Do you think we still need to find a key? Hmm. Oh, the cane. From the grandpa? Shimizu? Is there something we need to... Oh. Do I have an inventory? Oh, I do! the same menu as uh, Ondio. <gasps> Do you want the cane? That is fucking awesome. Oh, the lady shoes. Okay, let's look for the window reflections. She's probably here. This is her spot, wasn't it? These look creepy. Oh, it's the oh, it's the kid with his dad. Was the dad the drunk dude? No, I think we need to look for the dude that was up on the that fell on us. Oh, a cicada dude. Well, he doesn't like these shoes. What did I get? Oh, this is the kid. Let's go back. Was it here? Did I go too far? Oh, it's these ones. You can actually see it's a lot lighter. Okay, so now we have a beer and a shoe. So, cicadas. Any items? That's the lady who has the shoes. Ah, oh, cicadas. Okay. 
he has a bottle, so I'm guessing he wants the beer. This is really cool. I like this puzzle. Okay, now cicadas. That was all the items I could find. Should we go- well, let's go back to one side and see if we've placed something in all the cars. I think it might have been. Cane, toy, shoes, cicada, beer. The train stopped. <laughs> Jesus. Um, is it our cue to go? Oh god, oh god. Okay, time to go. Oh fuck. She's coming now. I don't know where I'm gonna run to though. <laughs> that scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> oh, please make it. Oh, you're such a slow runner. Can I close the doors? Maybe I should have closed the doors. Oh, it's open. Survive! Achievement unlocked! We did it! We chose the right station! Kisaragi. Kisaragi Eki. Um, why does it look so abandoned though? Is this our station? God, she scared the fuck out of me. Whew, my heart. Let me just have a look around just to be safe. Okay. I think we're good. Yeah. Let's see what's here. If we're actually out or not. How long were you on the train? Yeah. Oh, this doesn't look good. I don't want to be hit by a train. This is weird. Oh, there's a payphone. So... Kisaragi Station is an urban legend from a creepypasta? Is it? That sounds like a normal station to me. This phone booth only accepts 10 and 100 yen coins. I have a 10 and a 50 yen coin. Seems like I only got one chance. Who should I call? Co-worker, boss, friend, taxi, train station, police. Or not yet. Oh god. We can call one person. Who would you call? Police? This is so weird. Ghostbusters. Boss, you know they'll answer. I would call the police, probably. Not the train station, not a taxi. Police. Probably not a bad idea to call the police station. This is Ino no O. Ino no Police station. How can we help? Familiar voice. I've been to that station. It's me, Kensuke Tanaka. Ah, Kensuke! Let me guess, is it about your wife again? No? 
We've been investigating her case, but there hasn't been anything significant. What happened to my wife? No, it's not about her. Has it been two years already? Is he even listening? I don't have much time. I have to tell him my situation. I like his work ethic, but he has a bad habit of speaking before listening to others. She suddenly disappeared, correct? I feel you, but never give up. Surely there's a way. The phone hung up. No change left. I guess I have no choice but to walk along the tracks. How long will this take? Fuck! Oh no. Well, here we go. One useless officer, yeah. Well, there's no light beams after this one. Why would there be tracks, though? In such a weird place out of the station. Oh god. Should we go back? Oh, too late. Lost in the station. What? I wonder if there's a checkpoint in the train as well, just before you have to listen to the thing. Okay. Um, try friend. Hello? Hey, this is Chao. It's me, Kensuke. Oh, Kenchan! I remember you. Chao has been a great friend since elementary. His real name is Chashima Uta. I like him. He's trustworthy, energetic, caring, you name it. Why'd you call me? Were you thinking about me? Well, I'm just watching TV, featuring some rare cicadas or something. Cicadas, huh? I'm not good with cicadas. I remember one student would always bring them to school. Sixth grade, I... Yes, that was sixth grade. Kid would bring them in a, on a, in a bug cage. I would understand if it was some stag beetles, but why cicadas? They're so loud and annoying. Oh, and about the kid with the bug cage. I remember you would kill all of them during recess. Me? How horrible! Kid brings bugs to school and you kill them? That was a bit cruel, don't you think? That was absolutely horrible if I did that. No, that was... Daishi would cry a lot about it. To be honest with you, it was a little scared. I was a little scared of you back then. Well, not anymore though. Haha. <laughs> I'm glad he's not taking it seriously. My mind wasn't in the right place back then. But that's not important. I need him to pick me up. Hey, I need you to... He hung up. Ugh, oh, what am I doing? I have no change left. Walk along the tracks. How long will this take? Ooh. That's really bad that we did that. King, thanks for the sub. Taxi next? Maybe boss? I'm interested to see what my boss will say about me. Oh, here's the last light again. There they are. So cool! It's seven people. They all look different. That you were fired ages ago? Oh, maybe. Sounds like we were kind of a dick. Yeah. The teacher should be around somewhere. He gives you the right answer. Oh, really? Survive the chase. Oh, so it's not. Oh, yeah. And there's an achievement. Call home. Get killed by the girl. And get off at the right station. So we got off at the wrong station. Yeah. So we'll have to restart the game. <gasps> no! Shit. I, actually, I clicked back into the game and now I clicked on this. Fuck. He's usually- oh, co-worker's a dude. He's usually willing to help me out. Uh, hello? Is this show? It's Tanaka. Mr. Tanaka, what's wrong? Why are you calling me at such a time? Hey, I need you to come pick me up somehow. What is that sound? I think I hear a woman crying over Sho's phone. Hey, is someone crying near you? Uh, yeah, my girlfriend's crying. She sometimes starts crying when I remember things. When remembering things. What do you mean? 
That's right, it's cute, isn't it? In middle school, her friend would always get bullied by some students from another school. She would remember that and start crying. Well, it's something that happened way back. Her friend is from Kumanotsume Middle School. Kumanotsume. That's the school my wife went to. Yeah, my girlfriend, she's always like that. Always lending an ear to those who need it. Phone hung up. It's hard to understand this situation, but his, if his girlfriend was crying, he would... If his girlfriend was crying, he wouldn't be able to pick me up anyway. Hmm. Okay. Um, can I quit the main menu? Okay, this might put me just on desktop, but... Maybe we can just do that. I can load in like that and call. <laughs> Let's do that. Because I want to hear more of them. Uh, taxi. Target... Calling a taxi is calling a taxi is the right thing to do. Thank you for calling Tsuru Taxi. It's a female voice, quite rare. Most taxi drivers have seen a Ren. I'd like to request a ride. Where should we pick you up? Well, from what I can see, I'm in a station called Kisaragi. Never heard of it. What kind of an attitude is that? If you don't know, why don't you search for it? May I get your name, please? I'm Tanaka, Kensuke Tanaka. Mr. Tanaka, are you Eiko Tanaka's husband? Yeah, but... Oh, so you are! I'm Kaya, friend of Eiko. Kaya's a friend of my wife since back in middle school. It's been two years since the incident. I guess it's time to tell you this. Eiko's been feeling very regretful of what happened in the past. She really didn't want her husband to know. The past? What happened in the past? It was when we were in 8th grade, our group. Hello? The phone hung up before she could explain. <gasps> At least I was able to let her know the name of the station. Why do I have the feeling she'll never come? What was Eiko hiding from me? No matter the secret, I would never hate her. I have no change left. I guess I have no choice. Let me look up Kisaragi Station. I think it's an actual station in Tokyo. It sounds very familiar. Kisaragi Station. Oh, it is a Japanese urban legend, yeah. Boston train, okay. Hello, this is Kato. Mr. Kato is my boss at work. At his request, everyone calls him Kato-senpai. Most of his subordinates are young, but he's well respected. I can tell that he cares about his workers on a personal level. Kato-senpai is Kensuke Tanaka. Kensuke, what's happening? Senpai, do you have a moment? Sure. Speaking of which, when you were in elementary school, you remember Daishi Michishita, your classmate? Or was it Daishi Takahashi? Yes, I do. Why now? Now is really not the time. I know it's a thing in the past, but I can't stop thinking about him suddenly. The poor guy, his parents went through a divorce, and I remember his dad would always bring some cicadas in a bug cage. I vividly remember how happy he was when he would receive his father's gift. Oh, we killed some really precious gifts. Why, Daishi, why would you disappear like that? And just now it came to me that you might know something. I remember one time he mentioned your name, he... Hello? The phone hung up. Hung up. I was hoping he'd pick up, but I couldn't say anything. What am I doing? No coins left. Train station. The station should be able to help me out. Thank you for calling. This is Torinoha Station. Yes, so I just got on the final right to the Usaki station. Thank you for using our service. Did you lose something? No, I'm calling because the train didn't stop at the station I was supposed to get off at. I'm sorry to hear that. And I don't know where I am, I just want to go home. I'm sorry, which station are you on right now? It's called, um, Kisaragi? Kisaragi station. Kisaragi, is it? Please wait a moment. Please hurry. To my surprise, she replied almost immediately. I'm sorry, I couldn't find any station called Kisaragi. What? But I clearly saw the name. The phone hung up. Are you saying the station doesn't even exist? I'm in Kisaragi right now. There's no doubt about it. The station worker probably thinks it's a prank call or something. Okay. Okay. So, time to start a new game. Okay, what's the... What's the song? So, fun fact, actually. Um... 
in Japan, each station has its own song. And it's basically for people to... That's the song. We have to remember that. Okay. Dun 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 dun. Okay. Sounds like the first one, kinda. Um, so in Japan, I've only really noticed it in Tokyo. I don't know if it's for the whole of Japan, but each station has, has its own jingle so that you can really tell where you are even if you don't like look at the signs because a lot of people are on their phone and everything and um, that way okay I have to wait for flushing um, it's so weird I've never really been able to tell them apart but I'm sure if you really like if you commute there daily then I'm sure you start recognizing your own song and you know like then you start remembering the song before your station etc etc uh, now you can really hear it dun, 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 dun. okay here we are hello dude so now we gotta okay let me put my knee down <sighs> oh bang it into the desk. Focus mode. Okay, so now we need to listen. Turn my volume up. This doesn't sound like it, right? No. Okay. I have my volume all the way up. <laughs> okay, and then the second... Oh, maybe this is randomized too. Okay, here we go. No. No, this isn't it. There's so many yeses in there. This is the one we chose before and it's a no. It has to be the third one. Hey wifey. You're my wife now. You don't have a choice. Thanks for the resub. Hey, freakish! Thanks for the 15 months! Holy shit! Oh, this has to be it. Yeah. I think this is it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, we got the achievement. Nice, we did it. Okay. I'm excited. Show me. Are we gonna go through the whole death thing again? The red train and everything? Oh yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, yeah, we have to get a ticket. Oh! You can actually see it! Well then... Scary. Still spooky. Oh, 
Oh, you can see the door open. <laughs> oh god, Jesus. Oh, still scary. Oh no! She just came so quickly this time. Oh, I hope there was a checkpoint. <gasps> we still made it. And the dude's here. Looks like he made it. I don't know how, but I did. This isn't the place for you. We're gonna need a ride home. But I don't have a home. Don't worry, just call home. They should know where to pick you up. Call them now before you get lost in the tracks. Okay. I'll do that. Oh, that scared me. Okay, let's try call home. She came out so quickly though, there was no way I could have run away from that. I didn't even have time to turn around. Because when I did it before, she came out so slowly that I like messed up my turning around, but I still got away. Now let's see if we can call home. There it is. I know that no one will answer. But I have to follow what Mr. Shimizu told me. Yes, hello? What? I can't believe someone answered. Who could it be? Um, hello? Who is this? This voice. I know this voice. There's no doubt about it. It's my wife. How could this be? I called this number many times, hoping that someone would answer. But no one ever would. Uh, excuse me. I should hurry. I only get a few seconds until my minute is up. Eiko, when did you come home? I've been looking for you ever since you left. It's hard, look, it's hard holding back my tears. However, now is not the time. Kensuke, where are you? Kisaragi. I'm at Kisaragi. Kisaragi Station? No, don't tell me. What do you mean? What did I do? So, you too. I know exactly where you are. Stay right there. I'll be there soon. So she's here too? Don't walk on the track. I mean, nothing happened before. Seven people showed up at the end. Let's see if we'll see her this time. There's a car! I couldn't believe my eyes. It was my wife's car. She hasn't changed. I took her into my arms and cried. I'm glad, she whispered, patting my back. I held her hand and got into the car. You're here too early, she said as we were driving. I didn't know what she meant by that, but that didn't matter. All that mattered was, all that, mattered was that I got to see her again. We didn't have much of a conversation during the ride. There was so much to ask, yet there wasn't much to be said. I was happy enough to have her presence next to me, and rather soon we arrived at my place. She dropped me off and unlocked the door to my apartment, and just as I looked back, excited to invite her in, she was gone. Hmm. Without making a single sound, she had disappeared. So my wife is like my guardian angel. She's dead, but she actually pulled me out of purgatory. Today I live a normal life as a salaryman again. Wondering every night if I'll ever be able to meet my wife again. So that's why she was like, too soon. You're here too soon. She knew it wasn't my time yet. So she saved us. 
We're not dead. Yeah, the wife is dead. That's cool. That's really good. That's cool. I like it. That was a good ending. Um, I wonder if there's more than one ending. Is this just credits again? Yeah, okay. Oh, Andy, you have the guide open, right? Are there two endings? More endings than that? The wife killed herself jumping in front of the train. I don't know. She just disappeared. I think if she... If she would have jumped in front of a train, her body would have been reported and found. I don't think that's what happened. Because she's been missing for two years. So now we just know that she's... Oh, no, wait! They just say it's two years since the incident. So maybe she did die in a train, yeah. I don't know. BMM, thank you so much for the sub. Thank you. Just says you can call the other numbers to see what they say, which we did. Yeah. What if you stay on the train and don't get off? Oh, yeah. If you don't get off at all. Well, I'm sure then you just end up... Because the... The dude said that we shouldn't go where he was going. Shimizu? We'll probably just go to the doomed ending. The same, I think. Wife was bullied in middle school. Yeah, and we were a shitty person as well. They didn't have news. Yeah, so... Oh yeah, at the police station, right? So she was missing. Are the games from these devs connected? I don't think so. I think it's different every time. Like a news story. The incident refers to her disappearing. Yeah, I think so. This is Chilla's art best game. What is his best game? The Inunaki Tunnel one was really good as well, but it's also just because the story was scary. The real story linked to the tunnel. I still like Okaidi a lot as well, but it's also just really short. The convenience store? Convenience store was good, but it didn't stuck with me as much. Okaidi I think was good because the title is really shocking when you get to the ending. Because um, it's the mom figure who always will say, welcome home. Kokaidi. And then what happened to the mom without spoiling it is was was shocking. I like the convenience store, but it was too long. I think, yeah, I think that one has too much busy work in between, like doing the trash and the products in the store and stuff. It was a bit much. Um, but yeah, that was good. I'm really happy I played it after all, because the, the reviews were mixed, I think, for this one. And then I looked at some of the gameplay and it was I just saw the dude like going back and forth on the train. I was like, well, if that's it, then maybe it's not that interesting. And that's kind of why I've been putting it off. But I'm glad we gave it a shot, honestly. It was better than I thought. Story was good. The kid one's also good. The, um, the missing children one, you mean? That one was good, yeah. Missing children. Yeah, it was good. Go cool going in between the houses of all the families. Yeah, it was interesting. Ondio was really good too. Um, it was a bit a bit hectic. It's a bit stressful, but uh, I loved the camera mechanics because it's Fatal Frame-ish, I guess. They're good. 